Today, I am very, very sad. The reason for that is because my experiment has failed. And the reason why, I'll show you. This is the sunset moth from Madagascar, Chrysiridia rifius. However, it seems that the pupa have failed to emerge properly. Which really sucks because this species is very hard to get for me. And it may take years for me to find uh, more pupa of this species. The pupa of this species are very sensitive and they need the right humidity. But um, transporting them can also damage them and stress them. And it looks like my adults were shipped uh, and they were shocked from the transport and are now crippled. That means uh, here we have one and uh, it did not expand the wings. It just remained like this. I think it's already dead. They have very low uh, vitality. Here we have more cripples. Man, that's such a shame. I'm very sad now. It's going to take me a very long time to find anyone who can send me new pupa. I've waited for four years, four years to get these. And then they fail. Failure is part of our hobby, guys. But it still really sucks, man. Should have been one of the most beautiful moths on earth. <clears throat> the reason the pupa are so sensitive because um, normally the pupa hatch in 10 days time. And uh, it means they have to be shipped very fast. And shipping them uh, while well, the adults are uh, almost ready to emerge. Um, well, it can uh, disturb their development. It looks like this is what happened here. As you can see it still has some very nice iridescent colors. But yeah, I'm very let down today. Let's see the underside. Maybe we can see the underside. Here's some colors. This would have been beautiful, if not for this massive failure. And this isn't even my first failure today, because I was very excited to rear um, the biggest species of Altamiris on Earth. I think one of the biggest, called Altamiris Janus, but look at this. All the larvae died. They shriveled up and died, they stopped feeding. So it means that I lost two species today that were very special to me. And it really sucks. So, yeah, it's a very bad day for me. It's a very bad week for me. I don't know what to do next. Of course, I'm not quitting this hobby. I mean, failure is normal. Failure is normal part of our lives. And I'll be back with more interesting species soon. But I really hoped I could uh, show, I could have uh, showed my viewers these pieces, you know. It would have been so nice to uh, show uh, an actual uh, sunset moth. That wasn't, well, a complete mess. I even put in a special emergence box for them. With high humidity and heat. But no, it couldn't matter. But I promise you, st stay tuned and keep watching my channel. And someday, someday, it doesn't matter if it's now or in a year or in five years or maybe ten years. But I will be able to film a, a real nice specimen of the sunset moth one day. A live one. And uh, I'm going to keep this alive. Maybe they'll lay eggs, probably not, but you never know, man. Thanks for watching anyways. Love you guys. Goodbye.